Good evening, good afternoon, and good morning from anywhere in the world. Welcome back to our Global Weekly Updates. My name is Ken Jung, and I want to bring you a very, very exciting trip by the Vietnamese President Nguyen Xuân Phúc to the United States. And he did three main things that will really change the U.S.-Vietnam business relations. So actually, as of today, September 22nd, he is in the United States and he's been there for about four days uh, doing a lot of very exciting things. I want to cover three main items. One is the purpose of going. Two is the various government activities. And three, the economic activities that he's doing over in the U.S. So we'll begin with the first one. Uh, the Vietnamese uh, president, Mr. Wing Sung Phuc, uh, who represents the political side of the Vietnamese government, is in the United States right now. He's in New York. And the purpose of going is to uh, attend the United Nations General Assembly to discuss Vietnam's position along with all the other countries around the world regarding the COVID situation, how there can be fair and equitable distribution of vaccines available to Vietnam and many of the other developing countries around the world. As you know, we are in the middle of the pandemic and Vietnam is handling really well, but it can also do a little bit better. So that is one of the reasons why uh, the president is there in New York. The second item is every time the Vietnamese government goes to the U.S., they meet with the Vietnamese American community uh, from Washington, D.C., California, Texas, Florida. They all flew in to New York to meet with the prime minister and other delegates in the group in order to talk about the U.S.-Vietnam relations, updates on the vaccination, how Vietnamese Americans and the Vietnamese government can work together to continue to build U.S.-Vietnam bilateral trade uh, in general, but also specifically dealing with uh, Vietnamese Americans and Vietnamese overseas and what matters, concerns, and issues that they have. So there were many uh, business owners, uh, politicians, community organizers and nonprofits in New York. Uh, Fobosa TV has a very good uh, live stream that you can watch on their channel. So I want to give out the shout out to our friend and collaborator Fobosa TV. You can watch live. And then finally on the economic side, extremely exciting because one of our clients, Bamboo Airways, where we handle the entity formation and the corporate legal advice for them for the expansion into the U.S. market. We've been doing it. We've been keeping it hush hush. But as of the 17th of September, uh, the uh, president, Mr. Dang Tak Thang, is in the United States. They had a grand opening ceremony and they signed three big documents that will propel the future of aviation in Vietnam and Bamboo's uh, position. The first document they sign is with GE Aviation for the spending of over $2 billion for the purchase of various different planes of different sizes from the uh, 787 to the Dreamliner, the 777 and other uh, air, aircrafts in order to support the direct flight from Vietnam to San Francisco on the 23rd of September. So pretty much tomorrow, it'll take off from Vietnam here in Hanoi and fly directly. I said directly, not through a transit, directly to San Francisco. That is huge. That's going to revolutionize the travel between the two countries. It'll cut the time down by six hours. Uh, no more layovers. So that's going to help our, our business people, help our clients, help ourselves when we travel. And of course, it'll help the tourism industry. So that is very exciting. On behalf of Young Global, we want to say congratulations to Mr. Tang and also the team we work with very closely is the legal team, um, Mr. Hai and others on the legal team to help uh, be a small part of this monumental moment for Bamboo Airways. And the plan is from now until the end of the year is to have three flights uh, per week going to the United States. So I hope you will take that flight, fill up the seats, and then come to visit Vietnam on the 15th of January when Vietnam will open up again 
for the rest of the world to come back into Vietnam. Here at Yung Global, we're excited about that. We're excited about the uh, president, Vietnamese president's trip to the United States. As a Vietnamese American, I am proud to see the relationships continue to grow uh, politically, economically, and socially for the next 25 years. And as we stated in a previous note, uh, the U.S. Uh, uh, government is building a brand new $1.2 billion embassy in Hanoi, and I'm sure they'll also update the consulate here in Ho Chi Minh as well. So on behalf of Yung Globe, I'm excited. I hope you're excited. Uh, but make sure in order to get the most updated information and our global weekly updates, subscribe to our YouTube channel, like our Facebook page, comment below about your excitement or your reservations about this trip from uh, our president here, Vietnam's president. And also uh, click on the bell for notifications. Once again, on behalf of Yung Global, my name is Ken Yung. I am happy to announce that Bamboo is going straight to the U.S. And I'm happy that our client is expanding. So thank you very much once again for watching this video and I'll see you next week.